What's up? I wanted to go back and get this stick. <laughs> okay. It is very hot outside. Am I recording? Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so hot. I'm sweated out. I'm like sweated out. I'm so uncomfortable. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to my channel. Okay, what's good? It's very hot outside, which is very annoying for me, especially because I have to wear my hat. Technically, I don't have to, but I want to because I'm too insecure to show my hair. Just get. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to my channel. Um, what is good? I am so hot, I can't do this, this is too hot. We are confident, bitch. <laughs> confident. How are you? I hope you are doing well. I hope you are staying safe. I am going to be reacting to Lady Gaga's new album. Lady Gaga, as you know, is my childhood hero. I love Lady Gaga. So I've heard two songs of the album, which are Stupid Love and Rain On Me, which are both like bobs. And Rain On Me, I have it on repeat. Rain On Me is that. <laughs> <laughs> so today I am reacting to Lady Gaga. Wow, I kind of the same the name, it's like a pleasure. <laughs> I do have a feeling this album could be album of the year. The first song is Oh my god, why does she have the title of a title of an album that I can't even pronounce? <laughs> Chromatica one. Is that like phase one? Is that like first part of the album, because we have Chromatica 2. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you are new, and you get to follow me on it. Um, I could never say that part. You can follow me on my other social media in the description below, like Instagram, etc. <laughs> so let's react. Lady Gaga, one of the greatest artists of all time. New album, let's start the journey. I'm ready for it, let's start the journey. Oh my God, I don't want to do this. <laughs> let's get to it, okay. Instrumentals and when instrumentals are like this, I'm shook. Like the violin is piercing through my skin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, she's entering Chromatica and the instrumental is going into Alice. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> okay, so Chromatica word, the first kind of song. Um, well, no words, but it's a pop. <laughs> it's a great, it's an amazing instrumental, very beautiful. Okay, next song, Alice. Okay, wow, okay, we're in for the first, like, first proper song. And it's already sounding incredible. Oh, wow, I'm sweating. Oh my God. I felt my heart attack. <laughs> this is going to be so insane. Oh my God. <laughs> Okay, let's do this. Okay, we got this. Okay. The first song begins. Just that 24 seconds of the song Alice. Truly wow. Okay, I need to start the song again because I haven't heard the lyrics. I'm gonna try and calm down. Okay, I need, I need a drink. I need a drink. Okay, I'm still alive. Well, I can't feel it though. My heart's not beating. <laughs> Let's start Alice again. Okay. Oh my 
Yo, we are getting Lady Gaga. Like, we are getting Lady Gaga. You are being blessed by the artist of one of the old time. Oh, I can't even speak English. Oh, I'm shook. I'm so shook. <laughs> I have so much spit in my mouth. Can I talk about her um, vocals in the song? It's insane vocals. <laughs> Oh, I really wish my my cat was here to listen to this. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Playlist. Thank you very much. I'm not sure I'm going to make it. I'm going to try. And that's where the album really begins. Oh, wow. So, like, so she's in a place where, like, she doesn't know if she'll make it out of this place. She's still going to see where she's going to go out of this place. Lady Gaga, let me tell you, girl. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> no, no. I didn't mean it that way. I'm shook. Honestly, Alice is probably already the best song on the album so far. It's just insane. It's so gaga. It is so gaga. Next one is Stupid Love. So we already heard that and then Rain On Me. So two we've heard. So I'm just going to sing along and dance along. Okay, but Alice, absolute bop. Love the fact that it's a meaningful song. But the, the, the sound of the song, every the, the changes, it, just, it started perfect from the beginning. That's the thing. Like, it's not like the song build it up to sounding good, it just started straight away like Wow, what album of the year? This song for me is already album of the year. <laughs> Next song, Stupid Love. I'm gonna choke on my phlegm, but I ain't missing Lady Gaga. <laughs> I feel like I wanna wear this hat, this reaction. I feel like it could be so much more suitable. <laughs> Okay, next. Okay, okay, next. I'm just skipping. Stupid love is a bop. Just watch my reaction. <laughs> Rain on me. Okay, it's also a bop. Rain on me. So I don't lose my mind. on my face. I'll be your galaxy. I'm about to fly. Rain on me, tsunami. Next song, someone we haven't heard, Free Woman. This should be very powerful. Oh my god. I'm reading what Free Woman is about before I even heard it. She was sexually assaulted by a music producer. To compound all of my feelings about life, feelings about the world, feelings about the industry. To define myself as a survivor or a victim of sexual assault. I just am a person that is free who went through some fucked up shit. Wow. I had no idea about that, by the way. Can I just say something? The title's Free Woman and the song, the beat, the instrumental is so freeing. Like, it's like free and you can literally like the the beat seems like it's floating and it's free and it's just like very chill and it's just like very like it is free do you get what i mean like it's it's free okay i don't know if you know what i mean <laughs> yeah wow Wow. Oh my god. I just got chills. I just got chills. Wow. And now she says she's going to define herself as no longer I'm going to define myself as a survivor or a victim of sexual assault. A person that is free who went through some fucked up shit. And yes, and I'm very proud she's like at that stage, but either way that is just so wrong what happened to her. I don't know who was the music producer, but I hope he's in jail. Highly hope he's in jail or locked up. Like you messing with someone's mental health for the rest of the life. That's something you should be punished for the rest of your life. Next song is going to be fun tonight. Okay, that is the last song of Chromatica 1. And I feel like the second part is gonna be like a completely different like style of music. Free Woman. Beautiful song, beautiful song. The ending especially, her vocals. I love that, I love that. That's like my favorite part of the song. The next one, Fun Tonight. Think it's so moved, I still entertain. I do <laughs> I'm sorry, do you hear that? Uh, in the background, that is just gaga. 
<laughs> I'm sorry, but that is just gaga. Uh -huh. Think it's wow. so moon that's still entertained. Uh -huh. I do it my best. Been on the way that I've been and been in with you. <laughs> Being drunk? I'm not having fun tonight. I'm not to love the face. I'm so confused. We didn't get a chorus. Having fun tonight. Interesting. Like my favorite song of the album. It's still a very good song. The way I feel the song, it's singing to basically someone she was either with or like it doesn't have to be with, but like someone that gives bad vibes, you know, or like someone that doesn't like see the potential in you. Chromatica 2. So that is like the second part of the album is going to be an instrumental. I'm literally going to shit my pants. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. It's happening. Wait, before that happens, I feel like it's going to go straight into 911. So I'ma just keep playing it. <laughs> I was not expecting that. <laughs> this is the future. <laughs> this is such a different song. Like, I'm shook. I have no idea what she's saying. I honestly can't understand anything she's saying, no. <laughs> Can I just say something? I would love for Troy Sivan to be a feature on this. Troy, C Troy Sivan, Troy Sivan. <laughs> I could just feel Troy being on this chorus. Mm. This is a bop, but can I just say it's also a grow bop. The reason it's a grow bop is because it's so different. I feel like at first people are going to be like, Whoa, like what the hell is going on here? But like this is a bop. Because it's such a vibe. <laughs> this is a bop. This is going to be such an underrated bop. I could already see myself being vibing to this like 24-7, but the only one to do it. <laughs> it's so it's like an 80s disco. Mix with the future robots. Shifting my mind places, wish I laughed to get the good friendship. <laughs> this, this is a bomb. I love this song. This is one of my favorites. 911 is one of my favorites. Okay, next one Plastic Doll. She's going in with this album. Wow. <laughs> That's such a mood. That is such a mood. That is so me. I spent too long dancing alone dancing to the same song. <laughs> that is me like every night in the kitchen. Wow. Wow. Her vocals, I didn't say. I'm pretty sure I've already said this, and I'll just always say this. Lady Gaga is on her own level. She is one of a kind, such a icon. This chorus. <laughs> Can you hear this? That I, 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 like in the background. Okay. Gaga. It's not one of my favorites from the album, but it's still an absolute bop, and it has one of the, my favorite choruses of this album so far. The chorus is just insane. The vocals in the chorus, but just the whole sound of the chorus is amazing. That was an amazing song as well. Well, all of them are amazing. <laughs> Next song is Sour Candy, which is featuring Blackpink. Really excited for that one because I love Blackpink. Da 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 da. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> Did you hear that? Okay, start again. Okay. <laughs> 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 
Please give me step up vibe. Give me the cool rush, you're talking on. The <laughs> Hard on the outside, but if you see inside, I might be messed up, but I know what's up. You want a real taste? At least I'm not fake. <laughs> 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 I told you Gaga was gonna do this in this album. Hey. Oh wow, I don't even know what to say anymore. I'm just out of words now at this point. I think I, I definitely would have wanted a bit more Lady Gaga in this song. But like, either way, it was still a bop. Instrumental was insane. Lady Gaga's low voice. That's what I, that's, this is what I wanted. This is all I ever wanted. Next song, okay. Enigma. Going in gently. I'm so blinded, mystery man. Woman thin down. Violet light fears. Okay. It's seeing real, or is it just a Sorry, I need to do it, but I was shook. <laughs> look at this. Look, look at the power. We could be lovers, even nice. We could be Oh, I want to get up. I want to get up. I want to get up. <laughs> this one of my favorite songs, Enigma. Oh my god, the transitions on this album, I'm done. I quit. <laughs> like it just floats from one song to the other and it makes sense, it has one big story. Enigma, one of my favorite songs, if not my favorite. How many songs do we have left? Cause I'm done. <laughs> Honestly, I, I was just so shook. I lost it out of my memory. All I can hear is just the power of Lady Gaga. Like shook, like shook. I hope it's not underrated. Enigma is that. Oh my god, the power in her vocals. I just couldn't cope. I could not cope. I, this album, <laughs> like, like I'm, I'm not coping, like I'm really struggling to cope right now. Next one will be Replay. I want to replay Enigma. Amazing, amazing. Lady Gaga, you are doing something I've been waiting for so long. I'm really shook the way this is starting. This song is one of the best instrumentals. I don't know why, but the instrumental makes me think that that would just be summoned. Do you know if Egyptians were still alive? Instrumentals, how I'd imagine. They would be bopping to that if they were alive right now. <laughs> Album of the year. Wow. Like, she shucks me. <laughs> Replay, that was a bob, that was a bob. That just gave me such a uh, nostalgia feeling, I'm not sure why. The scars on my mind are on replay. That is so deep. Worst thing and the best thing that's happened to me, like, oh my god. Like, oh my god, I feel like I can relate with this song so much. Why are you acting dumb? I won't blame myself, because we both know you were the one. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> that is, like, I relate. I love the lyrics, I love the song, I love everything about it. Next, Chromatica 3. We in for the final stage of the album. And honestly, I'm glad because I'm sweating and I'm so tired right now from dancing that I I'm done. She really said we're going into dance. Oh, before, wait, 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 because I know it straight away is going to go to the next song. The next song after this is Sing From Above, which is Lady Gaga featuring Elton John. That should be very interesting. Sign, Sign, I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Sign From Above. Oh my god. Oof. Okay. What? <laughs> why is this song making me cry? I don't know why. <laughs> yes. Oh my god. I lived my days just for the night. So relatable. Wow, this is a beautiful song. It's a very, I like the fact that the instrumental is very like dancey, but it's also very spacey and it's very like euphoric. The lyrics are sad. I like, I don't know, like they might not be sad for everyone. Such a beautiful song, such beautiful lyrics. Oh, you gotta give me an instrumental, wow. <laughs> that was very confusing ending, but either way, the song is just so beautiful and amazing. <laughs> like, but so I'm just oh my god, spat. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> but okay, you and I, <laughs> Lady Gaga and Elton John both did that. But it's such a beautiful song. The instrumental is so amazing for starters. Very old vibey as well, kind of. Uh, like it's kind of like a techno kind of vibe. Do you get what I mean? Like the um, instrumental in the song. Okay, let's see what it means. The song. Let me pay tribute to the very thing that revived me. And that is music. Wow. So her sign was music, right? If it doesn't get nominated for album of the year, that's just an absolute scam and just completely not correct. Next word, thousand dubs. Leave me, I'm completely lonely. Please don't judge me when your teeth don't leave me. I'm not perfect yet, but I'll keep trying when your tears don't oh my God. When your smile is shaking, catch you as you fall. <laughs> when your smile is shaking, Send me, me, give me a Why is this so sad? <laughs> I never understand this, but. Spare me, please! Another beautiful song. Not a song I'll probably return to. Not now, at least, because, like, you know, I'm in, like, a sad stage. I don't want to, like, listen to the sad songs to make me more sad. But either way, a beautiful song. The lyrics, again, are very relatable. I'm completely lonely, please don't judge me. When your tears are falling, I'll catch them as they fall. See? Where she says she's completely lonely, but when your tears fall, even the, although she's like not in the best mental place, she will still catch your feet. She will still catch your tears. A small nudge, and I'll be flying like a thousand doves. Yes, like all you really ever need in life is a tiny bit of hope. Last song of the album. Don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> Babylon. Oof. The sci-fi. <laughs> Start again. We only have a week. Oh, this is gonna be insane. Babylon. 
Hey, it's a star. No! Oh no! That was way too short. That was a bop. Bob, and of course someone had to flush the toilet again downstairs. Why do you pee so much? Can you not pee outside? It's nature. <laughs> I need to gather my mind before I open my mouth. What a bop. There's so many singles she could use from this album. It's insane. Album. It's one of the best albums of this year for sure, if not the best. Let me start with the layout of this album. I love the layout of this album. Every song in the order is just perfect. The fact that she did a whole chromatica one, two, three. I just love that whole idea of this, like the whole like three parts of the album. And the fact that the transitions, the transitions from some of the songs to other songs are just insane and so smooth and just eargasmic. <laughs> and Gaga's vocals gagged my mouth. <laughs> Why did I say that? Okay. <laughs> Gaga's vocals are just out of this world. If aliens come down, I really want Gaga to be the first person that the aliens meet because she is the only reason aliens might not kill us all. Yeah, this album is so full of bops. Every song is a bop. Even the instrumentals are a bop. Production of this album was insane. I love how deep the album is. Like, she made us feel her energy her vibe she just made us connect with like i felt so connected in in this album of her i just wrote a long ass paragraph on twitter how much i love the album <laughs> i'm gonna use it to explain how i feel okay it's easier for me to type than to talk this album is everything i wanted like everything i wanted and more that's why i said it on twitter <laughs> you know it's so much more because i was just so shook non-stop and it's like i knew we would get it but i didn't know we would get it like that. <laughs> like, wow. Like, she used them pipes. She really did that. And just overall, this album has so much power and so much strength. And her voice just gave her that as well. She didn't have to do this. She didn't have to share so much. And she didn't have to, you know, like, it's going to be completely different. Could have been an album full of dancing bops, but meaningless bops. Whereas, instead of that, it's an album full of bops, but full of, full of meaningful bops. And I feel like that just takes it up and it just blows my mind how beautiful she could have done that in such a way. Thank you for sharing your story. All the best your way, always. And just, you know, keep killing it because, girl, you did that. <laughs> Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I subscribe if you are new. And I'll see you in the next one. Stay safe and, you know, go and chill. Go and chill and stream Chromatica. <laughs> Adios. Do -do -do. Thank <laughs> you.